let's see if we can make ourselves a small rubber band powered car. To start off, I'm going to use this as a phone charge card and make some wheels out of it. to use toothpicks or um, <coughs> cocktail sticks, whatever you want to call them, for the axles. And these cocktail sticks aren't very strong, the ones I've got. I've just broken that one. Anyway, there we are. That's four wheels, a bit of cardboard. It's corrugated double thickness just happens to be a bit of scrap that I've got now this rubber band car is not going to be breaking any records for distance or anything this is just for a bit of fun not going to be very strong either. Because I'm taking most of the strength out of it just by cutting this bit out the middle. Interesting. Don't know if there'll be enough strength. If there isn't, we'll have to change the back axle to something a bit thicker than a cocktail stick. Okay, need something to make a tag on one end. Okay, 
a rubber band. It's a bit too short. Box of rubber bands. Box tub. Let's try two. Together. Okay, just put the rubber band on there. Let's see what happens. problem. Not enough grip. Just give it another quick try. with a balloon. Just realised that was out of camera shot. So, we've got rubber wheels now. exciting one I've made. Not going to win any competitions with this one. Okay. 
Okay, done quite a few modifications to it to try and make it go a bit better. Um, I put a couple of guides on to hold the rubber band in the middle. I put bigger back wheels on, still with rubber um, balloons around them to give a bit of grip. Other than that, it's the same. Oh, the back axle is just a little bit thicker. Um, but other than that, it's the same bit of cardboard. Alright, you see that the guides are holding the rubber, rubber band in place. Okay, let's see how far we can go. Well, not an awfully long way, but better than the previous version. Okay, another modification. I fattened up the wheels by cutting some discs out of the bottom of a pizza uh, packaging bit of um, foam. It's about well, less than a quarter of an inch thick, but it's made them a bit thicker. So that's also added a bit of weight to it as well. So I've got a bit more rubber on the ground and a bit more weight. That should reduce the spinning a little bit give it a little bit more grip. So see if we can go a little bit further. We were getting well about three meters before. That look marginally further. Right, final modification, then I'm gonna give this little project a, a rest. Basically what I've done is I've made another body for it, which is about twice as long as the original one, so I can put a few more rubber bands on it. The rest of it's the same, I've retained the wheels, the axle, front wheels, front axle, so all that bit's the same. Really all I've done is lengthened it so I can get more rubber bands on. certainly improve the distance. Still not up to my target though. 